Hey y'all, it's Jessica from Sloppy Swatches. Today I have a very special Bestie Twin Nails with Mrs. White here on YouTube and Instagram. I'll link her social medias down below. To do this water marble, we use the new Dress Me Up 80s collection that's available right now from her brand, Savannah Lacquers. We were inspired by Elegante Nails for the pattern. You guys know I've been in a huge pattern slump, so I'm super obsessed with these. For sure, check out Mrs. White version. I'll link it in the description box as well and show you exactly how I did these. So as always, I'm starting with my tiny teacup full of room temperature filtered water. I do have one coat of pure Vitex polish across my nails as well as the Unicorn Poop Liquid Latex Nail Barrier from Cuticula. I'll link all those down below. So you guys know that these water marble awesome. I have already tested them. I'll link that down below as well if you're interested. These have no problem spreading and you can make a very nice bullseye with a ton of rings. You can really go as many as you'd like. So here I think I did two passes of each color starting in the rainbow order and ending with the purple. So next I'm going to take my water marble tool and then drag four points outwards like you would for a spiral. Then drag four points inwards and this is where it gets fun. So you're going to take the point and I try to look for one that had more of a tighter ring there. So I'm going to adjust my cup a little bit and then take my tool and then just swirl it all the way down. Elegante nails stopped with just one point. If you have shorter nails you could totally do that but because mine are a little bit on the longer side I went ahead and drug it all the way down to the bottom. This looks so cool in the cup and even cooler on the nail. I'm going to go ahead and dip it right there towards the middle and then gather up the excess. This is not a pattern that I could get a double dip out of but still really cool. So next I'm going to do some cleanup by removing this liquid latex. If you'd like your own, I do have my own affiliate code. It's Sloppy Swatches 10. Again, I'll leave that down in the description box as well. I'm going to go ahead and make sure that the pattern is completely separate from the latex before I remove. That way I don't pull up any of the pattern. I'm just using my water marble tool here, but I definitely recommend using tweezers so you don't bend that tool and this removed so well. I did have to do a little bit more cleanup with acetone and a cleanup brush. Next, I'm going to come in with top coat. I am using HK Girl by Glistening Glow for a nice, hard, shiny finish with no smearing. So here's a look at that completed mani. The pattern did get a little bit tight for me here on my index nail, but I seriously never wanted to take these off. Here's a quick look at what they look like under my black light, just for funsies. This is my swatch photo at an angle in direct sunlight, and that's it for today. So be sure to head over to Mrs. White's page and send her some love for me as well, and check out her version. If you'd like to see more photos, I do have those available on my blog at sloppyswatches.com, or you can follow me on Instagram at sloppyswatches. So thanks so much for watching, guys. See you next time.